Hi, this is Special Techniques and I'm Alex Capshaw Taylor of World Knits. In this lesson, we're going to learn how to do chain stitch embroidery. Chain stitch embroidery allows you to embroider on top of your knitted fabric. I used it in my design Harvey, the Harvey Gap cardigan to create these vertical zigzag lines along this shifting um, stockinette and garter stitch fabric here. So let me show you how to do that. So what you'll need to do is thread some yarn on a darning needle. And I have a little swatch here of um, this Harvey Gap fabric. And what you're going to do to do the chain stitch embroidery, we're going to continue the zigzag up these purl bumps here. So to do the chain stitch, what you're going to do is insert your darning needle into the same hole that you came out of. And then you're going to go into the next hole um, along this garter bump. And then I'm going to go back into that loop and pull this tight. And again, I'm going to go into the same hole that I just was in and then into the next garter bump. And then back in to the loop that I've just created. So back into the same hole and into the next garter bump. And you don't necessarily have to do this along garter bumps. You can do this on just plain stockinette stitch fabric. But what you're going to do, it's the same concept. So you create this loop, you go back into the loop, and then back into the hole from which you came. On Harvey Gap, the um, this uh, pearl ridges here, that really helps you to define where you're supposed to stick your needle in and out of. So here we go. Okay, into the same hole and then into the next pearl bump. Insert your darning needle into that loop that you just created. Pull it taut. Into the same hole. all the way down your fabric. So you can create some really pretty motifs using this technique. And last one. And to finish, since we're not creating another loop, all you have to do is now um, insert your needle. You can do it into the same hole, but don't do it into the loop. Do it on the outside of the loop to lock that loop in place. And then you just go and weave your end in on the back side of your work. This has been Special Techniques, and I'm Alex Capshaw-Taylor of World Knits. Happy knitting!